Hi, this is Anthony with a video tutorial on how to pay on Amazon.com using a gift card. I'm creating this video because some of my viewers requested for it. So I'm assuming you already have an Amazon gift card that you received, either a physical gift card or an email like this one. Um, you will need this claim code. Each gift card has a claim code and you're going to require this claim code in order to redeem it. So make sure, you know, it is a an Amazon.com gift card and not an Amazon.ca or CO.UK or Australian one because if not it won't work. You have to use an Amazon.com uh, gift card on the Amazon.com website. Um, so what you need to do first is log into your Amazon.com and go to the gift card section and then click on the redeem gift cards link and um, in this section right here in this little box let's say enter claim code you have to enter that claim code that I just showed you and then click the apply to your account button and then um, you know once you do that it's going to show up in your um, account currently I have uh, $215 in my Amazon.com account which I'm going to be using to purchase some uh, products so first obviously what you need to do is you know choose the products that you want to purchase so in, in this case for example this is one of the products that, that I'm going to be purchasing and uh, when you visit uh, the product page you will see this um, you know add to cart button so once you've decided that that's a product you want to purchase um, you know enter the quantity and stuff if it's just one then leave it as one and then just click on that add to cart button and once you do that it's going to add it to your cart so currently I've got um, uh, you know four um, items in my cart or products and if you click that little um, shopping cart icon it will display the um, the items in your um, shopping cart and um, once you've done that um, it'll basically show you uh, you know the total uh, items and um, as you can see here it also says your order qualifies for free shipping so I'm not gonna have to pay shipping on this and um, next what you need to do is just uh, once you're ready to you know check out um, you can click this proceed to checkout button you will then have to choose a shipping um, uh, address and um, you may already have entered your address when you you know open the account or you can um, you know use another address right down below here so I'm going to be using this address uh, here and so you just basically click the ship to address uh, button and in this step you you essentially need to choose the shipping preference in this section right here as you can see uh, there are a couple of options so I'm gonna go with this you know five to nine days uh, you may have Amazon Prime so if, if you do have that option will show up here and this second option right here it says you know group my items into as few shipments as possible you know it's always good to do that otherwise you may receive you know quite a few shipments um, and then uh, next is just basically click this um, continue button now um, you need to choose this payment option um, method in this uh, step right here and uh, as you can see we are going to be using uh, you know a gift card balance to make the payment so make sure that you check that um, box now the other thing you need to do is um, you need to also uh, enter your credit card or bank account information even though you're not going to be uh, you know paying it through your credit card or bank account you're just going to be using your uh, gift card balance you still need to enter that uh, uh, either credit card or bank account they have a few options here now they won't charge your credit card or bank account uh, unless of course your uh, your purchase exceeds the balance in your uh, gift card balance so I know that mine's not going to exceed and I've also confirmed that indeed they will not charge my credit card I've basically entered my credit card details in here or uh, you know just uh, chose that option and then once you've done that just click the continue button and uh, finally they'll ask you to confirm the billing address of uh, in my case I've entered the credit card um, and so I'm just going to say, you know, use this address. It's the same address that I have on my Amazon.com account. And then finally, uh, it'll display uh, the the final order. And uh, in this step, you should basically just review the order. You know, look at uh, uh, the shipping address, um, you know, the products, um, and 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 whatnot. And of course, check the price. 
um, as you can see right here uh, you've got the place your order button so once you're finally ready to you know uh, place your order then you click this place your order button and then once you do that uh, it's going to just uh, process your order now one thing I noticed was that uh, it charged me shipping and handling which should uh, should not have been there because uh, they said that my order qualified for sh uh, you know free shipping so what I did was I contacted uh, amazon.com using the um, online chat and um, I got it reversed so uh, as you can see right here they reversed it for me and uh, it was a very seamless process I really appreciate the, their customer service uh, and um, you know it was done really fast so in, um, what I'm saying is when you get your order before you hit the submit button just make sure you you know you check it out um, once you do that you will receive a confirmation uh, just uh, giving it the details and I'll give it the order number as well and you will also receive an email with the, with the same details alright so that's pretty much it um, you know hope you found this video useful if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and if you've got any questions please feel free to leave them in the comment section thanks for stopping by